UAE is planning to seed clouds. Well, in short, it's going to produce artificial rain. Scientists are using new technology to create clouds. The country is now making an effort to seed clouds and increase precipitation. United Arab Emirates meteorological official Abdullah Al Hamadi has said that cloud seeding increases rainfall rates by approximately 10 to 30 percent per year. Aircrafts would first take off dozens of salt canisters attached to its wings for the formation of these clouds. The plane then would release salt flares into the most promising white clouds, hoping that it will trigger rainfall. Aircrafts will shoot hygroscopic or water-attracting salt flares, releasing salt nanoparticles into the clouds. This would stimulate and accelerate the condensation process. Ultimately, this is what will produce rain. Although UAE for long has been adopting desalination process, which is making use of seawater or ocean water, now this can now be an expensive affair to, in fact, seed clouds to trigger rain. The process of seeding clouds is again not an easy one. It's quite intense for pilots, definitely not a cakewalk to seed clouds 9,000 feet above sea level. In fact, cloud seeding is considered the second hardest challenge for pilots as per one official. I'm going to quote that official here. He said, when there is a cloud, we try to figure out the way we need to go in and out of it and avoid thunderstorms and hail. Certainly not easy there. Now let's find out which are those other countries who are attempting at creating artificial rain. It was discovered by the USA in 1946. Later, it was launched by China in 1960. And now even Saudi Arabia and Iran are also planning to adopt similar practice. Impact on the environment, you ask? Well, according to a meteorologist, Edward Graham at the University of Highlands and Islands in Britain, the salt used in cloud seeding in the UAE does not harm the environment. For more informative videos like this, keep watching India Today Newsmo.